Well, we are here at the world famous claw <laughs> that was used to uh, do a lot of the cleanup activities after the Chernobyl accident. Um, and I've just got a simple uh, Ludlum Model 26 detector. I do not have the probe on it or the probe cover for dose equivalent, but we're, we're probably in the area of about 100 micro rem uh, this distance out. So I'm measuring in counts per minute. So this is about 21,000 counts per minute. But obviously, you know, if we get into where a lot of that debris was, that was being cleaned up, you can hear this thing really singing. Um, you've got a real hot spot over here on one of the back sides of this uh, thing where, you know, you just would have had, when they were using this, uh, debris that would have probably collected on any of the different horizontal surfaces. And you can hear this thing really singing. And so, I mean, we're able to just completely max the detector out uh, where it just over ranges. It can't even measure high enough to see the stuff that's here. So it sounds to me like we've probably got, if you listen to that, probably a small particle or you never know, it could be a little piece of fuel or something that was that was trapped in there and, and uh, that's what's causing that really, really high reading. But I'm sure that in these little pockets up here, it was probably horrible. And, and if we were to dig down in the center or bottom of that claw, we'd probably find quite a lot of activity there as well. But this is just sitting in the forest outside of Pripyat.